Hello and welcome back to the Sacred Gates Ascension podcast. My name is Ilura. So as you know, we have this lower Dantian, the middle Dantian, and the upper Dantian. So the lower Dantian is where we store all our, of our vital energy. This is where our vital, which is connected to our physical body and our physical health and our life force connection, our life force energy and chi on the planet in our life now. And this is really what we want to start working with. When, when you're starting to work as a practitioner or a teacher or you're working with a client, often this is a great area to start. A lot of people's vital energy is quite low, especially if they're under a lot of stress or they've been unwell or they're seeking healing because they feel imbalanced in some way. So helping to balance your own vital energy every day is very, very beautiful experience. It's, and the energy there should really be nourishing. Now, this is called the lower cauldron. And the reason why it's traditionally called a cauldron is because a cauldron, cauldron is something that you heat. And as you heat, the steam rises. And that's definitely something that's lovely to witness and observe and encourage and participate in with your own energy practice is the vital energy steaming up through the body, steaming up through the middle Dantian, which is all about emotion. It's the emotional center. It's the center connected to wisdom, like neutral insight and the opening of the heart chakra, like a window into your own being and, and looking through the eyes of your, your heart center and gaining insight there and gaining control of your emotions. So this area here has a lot of movement and change and so knowing how to allow emotions to rise up like steaming vapor and the air element is very much here is where we're balancing in the middle down TM. So it's very soft, light, becoming more celestial as we move away from that lower cauldron into the middle cauldron as we steam higher and higher up. And the upper down TM uh, which of course houses the third eye and the crown chakra, it be become even lighter, resonating in the energies of fire and turning into smoke and into the light and into all things that fire wants to grow and spread and lighten up as it grows and connect with the very higher beings and consciousness and lighter, higher energies, so a lot less dense. So we work from the vital energy of the earth, you know, working with our life force energy in the lower cauldron and working from that place up, steaming up, steaming up as we get lighter and lighter into water and eventually into air and then into fire. And all of this turns into vapor and then thus into lighter energies, just as we experience the elements on the planet. <laughs> so as we have the energy also we were talking about in another video, inclining from the quas and emptying out and emptying out down from the upper middle down into the lower cauldron emotions stuck in our head we can equally learn how to transmute in the lower cauldron any energies and allow them to be released up you know if you're irritated you can actually bring that irritation or grumpiness or anger or whatever it is you're feeling lower density energies use the ball to control them and then lift them through your being gently and allow them to feather off as you connect to the higher frequencies and lighter substances, more subtle energies of the upper, middle to upper, and then upper, 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 upper Dantian, and allow it to smoke off and feather off and taper off and take the edge off. It's a wonderful technique to use when you're feeling irritated or angry, maybe you're tired, whatever energies you don't really want to feel, any substances that are taking hold of you and you're choosing not to go down that loop, not to go down that pattern that you tend to go down, a really great way is to pull them into an energy ball, work, hold them, control them, condense them and then lift them through and feel the difference. I'm going to do another video now on feeling the different densities of the Dantian. So thanks for watching. Tune into the next video for that one. Bye bye for now.